So in this section, we're going to talk about how the e-drill system works. E-drill is the world's first handheld electro discharge machining tool that was specifically designed to remove the hardest aerospace fasteners. It has several main components, which we're going to go through in several lessons in this, uh, this training segment. But in this segment, we're going to talk about how it works. E-drill is controlled by an onboard computer on the power cart, also called the mobile service unit. You command the e-drill through the touchscreen display. Right here you load the commands that tell what fastener you're working on, and in turn, that tells the hand tool what to do. Once the hand tool knows what to do, you load the correct electrode in, and that is indicated on your touchscreen display. Locate over a fastener, pull the trigger. Once you pull the trigger, an electrode is going to descend and make electrical contact with that fastener. Whatever you're using, whether it's the externally grounded gun or the central grounded gun, a ground path is going to be completed, which tells the e-drill that it's time to start working. It says, I'm at center line right now. Looks back to the program and says, how far would you like me to advance? In this case, we're going to go down 120 thousandths of an inch to cut a fastener out. As it starts to descend down, it opens a water valve allowing high flow water to start flushing the area and high flow vacuum to start pulling debris away. So there's no FOD and there's no thermal transfer from heat. And when you're done with the e-drill cut, the fastener is just as cool as when you started and you've stayed inside the diameter of that fastener because all of our electrodes are undersized by 30 thousandths of an inch. That adds a safety factor in when considering damaging the airframe. 